When doing keyword research for YouTube, knowing the number of searches a month is important. In this video, we'll show you how to see the estimated number of searches a month in TubeBuddy. Hello TubeBuddies! Since YouTube doesn't publicly give out the number of search volume numbers, we originally had the search volume shown as a red, yellow, green bar like so. This is a score relative to other search terms that people have searched in the TubeBuddy system. If the give people a sense of how often a keyword is searched compared to other keywords on YouTube. Our calculation in Keyword Explorer, previously known as Tag Explorer, has been around for years and has helped millions of YouTube creators. I'll type in TubeBuddy. The calculation here is available in the free unweighted version, but the estimated number of searches per month does require the paid versions of TubeBuddy. If you'd like a TubeBuddy free trial to experience the weighted score, there will be a link in the description down below. That said, we'll select the weighted version now. TubeBuddy is able to come up with the red, yellow, green value without using the number of searches using our own calculations. We can't give out the exact calculations, we do have competitors watching, but basically, we look at how many videos are created around a topic to help us determine how popular it is. We use that info with our calculation to show our red, yellow, green value graph. The number of monthly search estimate is an actual number that we get from KeywordTool.io instead of a relative red, yellow, green value. It gives you an actual number. As we said earlier, the number of searches is only an estimate from KeywordTool.io, but it gives that actual value, which was requested by our users. Understanding that the number of searches per month is an estimate, we then run our calculation first and cross-reference it with the third-party SEO tracking site that we trust. This is how we can have a score without the number of searches per month estimate. Let's say that you're new to YouTube and you see a number of monthly searches estimate that equals about 50,000. You might be wondering, is that good? Is that bad? Well, 50,000 searches sounds like a lot, but some terms can get millions of searches a month so it's actually quite small. That's where that red, yellow, green bar is helpful because you just need to look at a color to know if a term is searched for often or not. But for people who dive deep into the details, they might wanna actually track the number of searches month after month. When looking at the data, you want it to be in the yellow to green ranges for all of these, especially search results. Now, speaking of search results, let's go ahead and look at it here. When using Keyword Tool IO, we can only get keyword numbers once per day from them. So basically, all day long, when people search in keywords in TubeBuddy's Keyword Explorer, we track brand new keywords that have never been searched before in our Keyword Explorer, and at the end of the day, we send a huge list of keywords to keywords.io and get a huge response and update our database with the new values. From that point forward, we have data for those new keywords and the data will be available. It's just brand new keywords that have never been searched for within TubeBuddy that take 24 hours before we can get results, assuming that there are at least 50 plus searches per month for that term. Due to the trillions of keyword combinations people search for, and that includes one word keywords, multi-word keywords, and all the different combinations of words, we can't get the estimate for every term right away. What we do have is our calculation beforehand. We run that, and if there is enough interest in the term, meaning there are 50 or more searches, and or we can pull the estimate, we show the estimated number of searches in the Keyword Explorer results. What we at TubeBuddy hope is that one day, YouTube will release the YouTube search volume via their API, just like they did for Google AdWords. If they do, we will have the exact accurate numbers and we'll include them in our Keyword Explorer. In the meantime, we're just trying to give the best results we can for our users. We do our best to make sure they're clearly labeled estimates within our Keyword Explorer. Whether it's from us or another company, none of us have the exact number of search results, so we do our best to give clear information and label on our part when it's just an estimate. If you want more information on this score, we'll have a support article linked down below. Do you want to learn how to use Keyword Explorer? Then check out that playlist that's been on screen. I'm Andrew Cam from TubeBuddy, and thank you so much for trusting and believing in TubeBuddy and our keyword research tools.